Greetings and salutations, people of the internet. I'm Vasar Mark II, and welcome back to East Origins. Last time we left off, we did the intro. Now we're going to continue past the intro and into actual gameplay. So that should be fun. Alright, so but first things first, we're going to talk to this people. Talk. I'll be offering my assistance in this location. Everyone locating, locating everyone from here. If you get stuck at any point, please don't hesitate to get in touch. I'll do my best to help you figure out where you are, and where you need to go, and what you need to do. Sounds good. The Lila shell functions as a long-range long -range communication device. Its magic is very powerful. You can use it wherever you need to get in touch with me. Just remember, if you're ever having any trouble in your search, I'm only a shell call away. I'll be glad to help in any way I can. Okay. Crystal. The crystals were created by the priest Stabby, combining his power over light with the priest Hadel's power over earth. You should be able to use the one Father Shion gave you to purify any cursed goddess statues you find in the tower. You may already know this, but the statues will heal your wounds when touched and can even confer divine blessings upon you. And once a statue has been purified, you can warp right back to it at any time you want just by holding your crystal aloft. Should you ever find yourself in mortal danger, that could save your life. Sounds good. Anything else again? No, it's just uh, the same thing for that. Alright, and blessings. You can make offerings of spiritual power to, ex to the statues in exchange for many different c kinds of divine blessings. When demons are defeated, they often leave SP fragments behind, so make sure you pick them up. Okay? Sounds good. So let's take a quick look at the divine blessings. We got strength and armor, increased stationary heal, reduced damage from terrain, increased none effect, increased spiritual power gain, increased item drop rate, reduced bad statuses level 1, and essentially you get the point. Ideally, I think we want to increase SP gain first. Alright, anything you got to say? Since the demons built this tower, there's no way of knowing what awaits us here. If you ever feel like you're in danger, do not hesitate to use the crystal and return to us. It could easily save your life. Cool. I will make sure to use the crystal and return to you, if I'm ever in danger. The Wailing Blue. I like Wailing Blues. Oh hey, we got some more enemies. <laughs> Take this, and this, and that. Hi. <laughs> Bye. We're about as threatening as a potato. I don't know why I keep saying potato stuff. I haven't said it much in the series, but I always say potatoes. Oh, I think I hit him by not actually hitting him. Screw you. There we go. Come on. Yeah, there we go. We got ourselves a level up, too, which is good. We now have 65 health. Oh, hey. Here's an enemy. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Red. Apparently red means he controlled this chest. Give me this chest. Acquired Selectian Pansia times one. Okay, select the Infancia. Okay, at least the inventory isn't lacking the shit like it was before. <laughs> a potion made from a much-loved blue Selectian flower raises maximum health. Cool. Let's use that. It gave us only three more health. That isn't a lot of health, okay? I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Useful, to say the least. Next area. Alright, anything over here? Nope. Just some enemies. Die, enemy die. Oh, these guys are taking a bit more hits than usual. Here, will this help? Yeah, they're taking a lot of hits. Wow. <laughs> That's a difficulty increase if I do say one. <laughs> they take more damage. They're about as threatening, though. It's still the same amount of threatening, I should say. This looks like one of the holy artifacts of East. But why would the demons have it? Acquired the Cerulean Flabilium. A surge of power burst forth from the artifact. Unica was granted the use of the whirlwind skill. Artifacts of East bestow mystical powers upon their bearers. Activating the skills will launch various special attacks. Certain skills can be used to negate magical traps or activate mechanisms, opening up new paths. Some enemies are invulnerable to most attacks, but crumble under the might of certain skills. 
cool. Unica can move freely while in whirlwind form and dangerous and is dangerous than such. Okay. Gliding. By activating the whirlwind during a jump, you can glide through the air, greatly increasing the distance covered. The whirlwind provides cover for Unica while radiating razors like the winds in all directions, making it an ideal choice for when surrounded by enemies. Change your skill to unleash a much larger Charge your skill to unleash a much larger and more powerful whirlwind. After obtaining at least one emerald, press and hold the skill key for several seconds to charge and let go. The fault's to see, I don't care. Well, I had no idea there was so much power in this thing. It's not really magic, but like the sorcerer's cast, but it's sure close enough for me. I'll take whatever I can get. Cool. Sounds good to me. Now let's kick some ass. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he definitely crumbled under that. Alright, come on. Anyone else gonna try? I'm in interesting these guys on the top of the world I guess the red guys are special sometimes. Ooh, that is really bad. Shame it was useless. <laughs> Alright, anything else around here? No, nope, looks like we managed to kill everything. Alright. And up the platforms go. Where they stop? Well, they stopped right there. <laughs> now. Just gotta get ourselves across the platforms, I imagine. So let's do that. Simple. Yeah! See, I paid attention. <laughs> oh, hey, an army of enemies. Let's uh, deal with that real quick. And then we'll deal with the army of enemies. Yeah! Combat in this game is always just so satisfying. Hi! Bye! <laughs> Any more around? Yeah, we got a couple. We got a bunch of yellow guys around here. We got these guys as well, and we leveled up. Sweet. Give me that. And that. I saw that over there. Oh, and I see this over here. Hi. Bye. Threatening as a potato, I say. Boost Max. I like Boost Max. Alright, anything up here? Oh, we got red guys. Uh oh. <laughs> Eep! What's happening? Well, you can't move, and you're being sucked into a portal. Now you're over here. Where am I? A good question. Looks like a different room entirely. Yep. I guess that weird magic circle thing must have teleported me here. That's a pretty sophisticated trap for a bunch of demons. Yep. Crystal's power purified the demon statue. Sweet. And what's up here before I touch the demon statue? It's a peculiarly shaped depression in the altar. Hmm, peculiarly shaped. It looks like a moon. Alright. Divine Blessing. We can get the armor one, why not? I mean, it's not much SP. Your prayers have been answered. Sweet. Alright. Continuing the adventure. Anything over here? Oh, yep, there's an enemy over here. Goodbye, enemies. <laughs> oh, hey, we got a new enemy. Let's kill him before he does anything dangerous. Oh, he vanished. Alright. Oh, there he is. Take that. <laughs> Anything else? Nope. Got ourselves more enemies over here. Sweet. Screw him. Okay, so what he does is throws really slow magic spells. Gotcha. Oh, hi. You came out of nowhere. <laughs> Alright, avoid the magic. Take them out. Yeah. Another one down, another one down, another one bites the dust. And another one down, and another one down, and another one bites the dust. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Doesn't look like there's anything else around here, so we just gotta continue. Alright, so we're at dead end side one. We got ourselves another one of these magic dicks. Seems to be running away, and all the stuff fell down the stairs. How rude. And I think we leveled up again. Sweet. And I got hit. Also sweet. 
guy is also running away over here. Hi, bye. I think these things are also firing faster now. That's fun. Get back here, you coward. Alright, anything around here? Yep, got ourselves another magic dick. Stop running away, you fucking coward. Now, got ourselves this thing. Bye-bye to that thing. Avoid that. Take him out. Good riddance. How about you? No, oh, you're not gonna do anything. That's good. Alright. Just kill all the things. Okay, we're at a dead end. Good. Oh, hi. You came out of nowhere. And up we go, up we go. Where we stop? Who the heck knows? Alright, another dead enemy. And whoa, we're moving fast. <laughs> go. Sweet. And now we have a, we've raised a platform, which leads somewhere, so let's go check out where that leads. Gonna use the uh, whirlwind skill to speed ourselves up a little. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Acquired Rota Fruit 1. Cool. So we're eating a, a tree's children, right? Because it's a fruit of the Rota tree, right? Eh, who knows. Alright, so we got stairs to the left, stairs to the right. Let's go stairs to the left first. Because left is always the wrong direction, you know? Dodge. Yeah, there we go. Oh, take out one, another one comes. How exciting. <laughs> I'm fine with this. Yeah, I'm fine with them just continuing to appear. <laughs> there we go. I think we finally killed off all of them. Now, there we go. Beautiful. Give me that. Sweet. Alright, down the stairs. Oh, hey, we got another one. Ooh, and we got ourselves a red enemy. I like red enemy. Red enemy is best for dead enemies. Jesus, it takes a lot of hits. There we go. Killed him, finally. Alright, so... Okay, that would, that just disappeared randomly. <laughs> Ow. Oh, watch out. Incoming! Dodge. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah! Give me that chest. Acquired the emerald. Oh, hey, we should be able to charge the whirlwind now, then. Whirlwind power increased, yep. Yep, and that does all that stuff. We'll not worry about reading it. Doorway! Let's see where this doorway leads. Sounds like fun. I guess left way was the right way. <laughs> Usually right is the right way. But apparently if we went right, we would have had to go left, and then we would have had to go on right again. Hey, I managed to save myself some steps. By accident. Alright, then. <laughs> Come on. There we go, got ourselves another level up too, which means we're gonna take out these guys a lot easier. Yeah. <laughs> See how quickly he died? Come on, give me that. And then screw you. Yeah. I wonder if I could see the XP. It's hard to tell. I think that little reddish bar under the axe symbol is the thing, and above my health. Might be the XP, I don't know. Okay, it's a room that led to a chest. Acquired the blue moon crest. Ooh. <laughs> oh, hello there. What? Strange, if you're a demon, then why don't you- why don't I feel threatened by you? I actually think you're kind of adorable. Are you one of the ruse, maybe? My grandpa told me about you, little guys. Said the vapors outside transformed you into demons, but demon or no, you're just too cute. <laughs> I'd agree. It's hard to tell with all the pixelation. Well, 
via the sprite, but hey, it's definitely cute looking. Mm, yes. <laughs> I'm not really trained for this. I don't have any idea what you're saying at all. If someone run from House Gemma were here, maybe we'd be able to communicate, but I wouldn't even know where to begin. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't understand. House Tova has a proud legacy, but I'm afraid demon logistics just isn't a big part of it. <laughs> well, that's the universal sound of hunger to me. Wait, are you hungry? Is that it? I guess, yeah, the way it's jumping around and <laughs> stuff is... Yes. I'll take that as a yes. Hmm, come to think of it, I might just have food to give you. Give it a rota fruit. There you go. Heart. Okay. Whoa. Is that a piece of Clario armor? Yep. Unica's axe has been strengthened. Sweet. <laughs> That's amazing. I never knew you guys were so talented. <laughs> Paw print. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay, anything else you gotta add? <laughs> Flower. <laughs> Excellent. I feel like I've learned a lot. <laughs> Hi. Test out my new upgraded axe, shall we? On you guys. Oop, yeah, we're doing about double the damage we were before. 20 instead of 10. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Tearing through these guys at the speed of sound. They have no hope of surviving my axe that's being thrown around. <laughs> I tried. That's all I can say about that. Oh, hi. Two of you guys, or three of you guys, are about as threatening as the potato. That's powering a man cannon. I don't know what a man cannon is, but I just said it, so therefore it's a thing. Dodge. Kill. Kill and dodge. Dodge and kill. Dodge, kill, kill, dodge. <laughs> I didn't actually expect you to be there, but... Well, you were there. And I didn't expect you up here, either. Whoa. What the shit was that? <laughs> oh, hi. <laughs> bye. Hi, bye. Yep. I stood all of three seconds. And the last enemy of the day goes to this guy. Good job. <laughs> you were very helpful to your cause. How quickly do I tear through these golden dicks? Pretty quickly. <laughs> they didn't stand a chance. None of them did. Well, they didn't before, but they stand even less of a chance now. <laughs> oh, hey, we're back here. But yeah, with that, I think I'm going to end the episode here. I thank you so much for watching. I've been Eviscerator Mark II. This has been Yeast Origins. Be sure to like the video if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't. Subscribe and hit the bell if you want to see more. And if, but yeah, also be sure to f all the other links down below as well. But yeah, I've been Eviscerator Mark II. This has been Yeast Origins. Have a wonderful day.